Hi guys, uh, thanks for uh, visiting the booth. I really appreciate it. Um, my name is Arnold from Serafin de Cuba Cigars. This is our first time exhibiting here. Uh, we're showcasing some of our different brands this year. Uh, we've been in business pretty much since about 2003, but my family goes back to Cuba many years, um, central Cuba primarily. We used to uh, hand roll cigars there, my grandfather, and he also grew tobacco in the central region. And as of the result of that, this year we're showcasing his Don Ramon 1917, which uh, is a limited production cigar. Very proud to, you know, to offer this cigar. We made it in a uh, Churchill size, but a Cuban style with a pigtail and a folded foot. And it is um, a Nicaraguan Puro, really great cigar, featured with a Corojo 98 wrapper. So we're very proud of that, that cigar. Um, something else that we've also done We've brought back a lot of the old Tampa labels, like Florida Tampa. It's an old brand that was made back in the 1800s, um, had been defunct for many, many years, also doing very well. And another one that we're very proud of is the Prince of Wales, or Principe de Gales, which was a cigar that was originally made by the Ebor family, by Mr. Ebor himself. Um, very rich history, that cigar uh, was founded in 1853 in Havana. 1869 it went to Key West, and then in 1886, when Ybor City was founded, the cigar came to Tampa, and it was basically the creation of, you know, the whole Tampa cigar industry. So we're proud to have that cigar. With the blessing of the Ybor family, we were able to bring the cigar back to life after a, a hundred year hiatus. And, um, you know, that's pretty much what we've been doing. We've been, like I said, bringing back a lot of the old Tampa labels. I also made a cigar in honor of my father. We call that one the Don Ramon 1942. And that one is in a Connecticut wrapper, Presidente size which was what he really enjoyed. And, um, you know, we're just very honored to be making our, like I said, these tribute cigars in honor of my family. And in addition to that, the old Tampa cigars, we're very passionate about it, very passionate about the history, and very happy to be here at the uh, PCA this year showcasing our cigars.